Diana the Musical debuted on Broadway in 2021, with a filmed version later being released on the streaming service Netflix. Denise Welch is set to star as Queen Elizabeth II in a London production of a musical about Princess Diana. The show will also be coming to the UK later this year, with a concert version titled Diana the Musical in Concert, being staged for one night in the Hammersmith Apollo on December 4. The Loose Women panelist has since taken to Instagram and shared a throwback photo alongside King Charles, who was then the Prince of Wales, during his visit to Coronation Street. She captioned the post, Have you heard? The image showed the actress, known for playing Corey's Natalie Barnes, smiling behind her spot behind the Rover's return bar. The actress looked on at the royal while he gulped down a beverage at the bar. Taking to Twitter today, Denise announced she would be taking on the role of Queen which was met with applause. She penned, Queen. Diana the musical in concert. December 4. Apollo Hammersmith. Don't miss. Dr. Ronge says you won't get the full picture as ITV boss discusses complaint, latest, John Irwin leaves family home to stay in hospice during painful cancer fight, health, Strictly's Neil Jones Love Island star fiancé China Mills spills on baby name, Strictly, fans flock to comment on the post, as one person bent, yes. Queen. Helen Mirren left shaking. Another commented, amazing, a third wrote, that is such an honor to get a role like that. You're beautiful enough to play it too. A fourth added, love this Denise. You'll smash it. When Diana debuted on Netflix back in October 2021, the project sparked a divide among critics and viewers. Reports have suggested that the concert version will divide the story into two parts. Diana died from injuries sustained in a car accident on August 31, 1997, at the age of 36. She had divorced Prince Charles, now King, in the previous year. Queen Elizabeth died in September 2022, at the age of 96.